What I have here is a neat demonstration of Faraday's law of electromagnetic induction. So Michael Faraday was an English scientist who investigated electromagnetic induction in coils and loops of wire. And he basically found that if a magnet, like a bar magnet, is quickly moved into a coil, or a solenoid in this case, uh, an electromotive force, an electromotive force means the difference in potential that creates current, uh, is induced and you get current in the coil. So if I sh take my bar magnet here, so I've got north and south here, if I move it in and now very quickly, you'll notice that the needle on the ammeter, so this is a current measuring device, the needle on the ammeter will move, will be deflected. If I change polarity of the magnet, so now I've got south going into the coil, the solenoid. You notice the needle being deflected the other way. Okay, and that's to do with the polarity of the magnet itself. If I just leave the bar magnet inside, there'll be no current. The reason being is because Faraday's law of induction requires there to be a changing magnetic flux. And in, or in order to have a changing magnetic flux, you have to have motion between the magnet and the coil as follows. Okay, amazing how you get an electric current, electricity, just by simply moving a magnet in and out of a, a solenoid like this.